With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. So we are given that in a seminar, the number of participants in Hindi, English and mathematics are 60, 84 and 108 respectively. That is 60 for Hindi, 84 for English and 108 for mathematics. We have to find the minimum number of rooms required if in each room the same number of participants are to be seated. Okay. And all of them being in the same subject. Now, now number of Hindi participants. Number of Hindi participants are. 60 okay number of english participants are 84 and number of mathematics participants are 108 okay now yeah the rooms will be minimum if wait, rooms will be minimum if maximum number of students in a room okay it's a first condition and the second condition is that also, we have to take care that all students in a room are from same subject. Okay. Same subject. Now, we can find the maximum number of students which will stay in a room. It can be found out by finding the HCF of 60, 84 and 108. So let's do that. Okay. That is maximum students in a room, which will be equal in all the rooms. It will be equal to HCF of 60. 84 and 108 okay so let's do that yeah so let's do it by prime factorization so for 60 it's it will go with 2 because it's an even number so it's 2 30 is a 60 2 15s are 30 3 5s are 15 and 5 ones are 5 okay now let's find it for 84 so since 84 is also an even number it will also go with 2 so so 2 4s are 8 and 2 2s are 4 again it will go with 2 2 2s are 4 and 2 1s are 2 it will go with 3 3 7s are 21 and 7 1s are 7 now let's find it for 108 since 108 is also an even number so firstly it will also go with 2 2 5s are 10 2 4s are 8 again even number so 2 2s are 4 2 7s are 14 3 9s are 27 and 3 3s are 9 3 1s are 3 okay so since we have factors for all the three numbers so let me just write it down together factors of 60 are 2 into 2 into 3 into 5 for 84 it is 2 into 2 into 3 into 7 and for 108 it is equal to 2 into 2 into 3 into 3 into 3 now let's find the highest common factor that is i uh, that is a factor which is common in all the first so the first common factor is 2 2 2 that is 2 is common in all the three then again 2 is common in all the three then 3 it is common in all the 3 rest nothing is common 
So the HCF is 2 into 2 into 3 which is 12. So we can say the maximum number of students in a single room would be equal to 12. Okay. Now we have to find the minimum number of rooms. So we can say that the minimum number of rooms it is equal to total number of students that is from all the subjects that is English, Hindi and Mathematics divided by the maximum number of students in a room. Students in room. So we get it is equal to 60 plus 84 plus 108 divided by 12. So what we get so after addition we get uh, it's 252 and in the denominator it's 12. If we will divide these two we get uh, 12 twos are 24 and the 12 ones are 12. So we can say the minimum number of room is 21. So the minimum rooms are 21. Yeah. So this is the solution. I hope it is clear. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.